So the materials that you will need to make this Bop It charm are blue and yellow acrylic paint, um, purple clay, yellow clay, black clay, and preferably this color blue. And of course you will need something very thin to be able to um, write the Bop It logo and to put texture right here and of course to make um, the ends like right here and over here sharper you will need an exacto knife or some kind of cutting tool like a poly blade. So first you're just going to take some black clay and knead it a little bit and then take about like this much off and what you're going to do with this is you're going to roll it in your hands until it's even, like a ball like that. And then you're going to roll it into a log. And this part, we're making this part right now here, so... Just so you know where I'm at with this. until you get a shape like that. Make sure it's even, and then you're going to cut the sides just to make the sides like more defined, sharper edges until you end up with something like that. Make sure it's about the right size. Yep. And you're going to put that aside and now you're going to make this little piece right here, this black piece. And basically you're just going to do the same thing except you're going to make this a lot smaller. And then just do the same thing to that. So now that you have those two parts done, now we're going to go ahead and make the black circle. So that's pretty self-explanatory. <laughs> Just make a black circle and flatten it. like so. And then you're just going to go ahead and connect all of these. Then you should end up with something like this. Go ahead and put this to the side and we're going to work on the twisted part, which is the yellow part right here. So you're going to take some yellow clay Need it a little bit here. <clears throat> and then you're going to roll it into a ball. And then you're going to roll just this side. Don't roll this side. So that you're rolling kind of like a cone figure. Like this. Now you're going to go ahead and cut the bigger side. like so. And then you can cut this side too. And then you can go ahead and attach it to the shorter side. Now you'll want to texture it, like so. So basically you're just going to lay it flat like this and take this tool Now to make the pullet part, which is this part, you're just going to take a little bit of that blue
and form it into a simple shape like this. And then take another little tiny piece of blue, really small, and just put it on top. And it should look like that. Now for the middle part here. I'm going to take a little bit more of that same blue. Roll it and flatten it out. And then just put that on there. Now take some purple and just do the same thing. And put that on top of the blue, make it a little bit smaller than the blue one, the blue circle. And then it'll look like that.